I'm not even joking. Like, anyone in my community knows I'm not capping when I say that. Anyway, Grand Finals finally be able to begin here. Finally be able to begin. We got Vega versus Bandit. Vega on Mewtwo, Bandit on Ike. First game on Town and City. All right, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Grand Finals. Now, Bandit needs to win three games to force the... <coughs> the Grand Finals reset. Damn, one second, guys. All right, so first stop going to Vega. Bandit trying to win their second Cave Clash since Cave Clash 35. That's 36 Cave Clashes ago, just so you guys know. That's 36 Cave Clashes ago. I can't believe that. I find that very hard to believe. <laughs> and another star taken off of Bandit is Vega gets that fair off the platform and you just passed a minute of gameplay here in game number one in grand finals that's that comes out from bandit no stock sitting at 129 is vega this will be another fair dash attack once again another dash attack from vega and a fair sorry side b from bandit bandit looking to get a stock here with the back air and he does first stock Bro, this is Little J's bracket. There was no lust to interfere. <laughs> I'm dead. Sitting at 160 is Bandit on their first stop. I mean, our last stock, Vega at 60. Try to get the back here, not able to get that connect. Ooh, no grab as Vegas facing the wrong direction and there goes the up there to take the stock good stuff GG's to both players as Vega strikes on the board first I mean if you can't win on stream when it matters does it matter off stream no I mean like when I like like I'm not, I'm not saying like like when I have that focus because when I'm streaming it's very hard to take my focus off the of stream like in order for me to play the way I play off stream I literally have to like simulate that i'm off stream and that is very hard for me to do while i'm already in the headspace of streaming because like when i get there's a lot of mental prep that gets by that, that, that comes into doing this like streaming there's a whole lot of mental prep at least in my case i do a lot i do a whole because i got a lot going on once i'm in that like that mind state like that mind state that headspace it is very hard for me to play competitively like, it is very hard for me to play like, competitively. For me to play competitively on stream, I have to essentially go live on accident. So, like, for me to go live and not even realize that I'm, like, that I'm streaming. You know what I'm saying? I, like, like there wouldn't be the, like, I wouldn't, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the only way. And even then, it's like, you know what I'm saying? So, like, and y'all may call it Johns. That is fine. Y'all can call it Johns all y'all want. Y'all can call it Johns. It is what it is. I have proof. Now I can, there's people that have completely clapped. It says, it says Grand Finals Reset, doesn't it? There's people that have clapped off stream. And they probably wouldn't admit it, but this happens. It's definitely happened. All right. <coughs> First stock goes to Vega. Let's switch over to Bandit. Switch. Yeah, Bandit switched over to Sephiroth here for game two. I don't mind this switch. You would never catch me lacking that bad. I know you probably, I, mean, I probably won't catch you lacking that bad, but there's people that don't want to admit that I beat them. Well, I won't say their names. It's all good. All right. Sitting at 39% is Bandit. Bandit gonna get it back thrown by Vega. Vega making it back to stage. Trying to go for that really low down air. That's gonna be a fair coming out from 
Bandit. Bandit getting the grab to avoid the disable. Alright, Nair into... Try to go for an up air. If Nair comes from Vega. Vega will try to go for a dash attack. Oh, that was a really good side beat. Vega throws out the Shadow Ball. Kind of, you're wasting that a little bit. And the side beat into the dash attack for Bandit. Bandit throwing the tier 2 neutral B. Not going to get much out of it. Sitting at 100% is Bandit. Dash attack comes up for Vega. Does not connect. And the down smash does. No stock. Even facing the other direction, it definitely would. And there goes the stock from Bandit. As Vega gets that forward tilt. Sitting at 121%. They need one more stock to be on tournament point. Nair not going to connect. Bandit getting... <laughs> sorry, Vega getting the fair. Bandit making it back. Nair is not going to connect for Be for Vega, but it's thirty percent on Bandit's last stock. Oh, another fair coming out from Bandit. I mean, from Vega. I keep getting the next mix. I don't know why I get the next mix, but the days are completely different. And Vega now is on tournament point, needing one more game to be the winner of Cave Clash seventy one. He is now on tournament point and Bandit facing elimination here. I never tweeted out that grand final started. I just realized that. I never tweeted out that grand final started. That's crazy. We're in game three. I'm just now realizing that. Vega making this look like quick play. Yo. <laughs> Yo. All right. Game number three. Coming up here. Vega 2-0. Oh, oh, no. Not now. Why is the internet acting up now? Why is my internet acting up now? Hold on. There we go. I think I'm good now. Woo! That was way too close. The first stock going to Bandit. Bandit gets that stock off of Vega to start this one off. Grab into a forward throw. Sitting at 96% is Bandit. Bandit gonna go right into that orb. And there goes the forward tilt coming out from Vega. Vega try to get the back here, but missed. Grab, down throw. Vega try to go for the fair. Back throw. And that's gonna be stock number one taken off of Bandit. Just past the minute here in game number three. Shadow Ball. A quick 41% on Bandit already from Vega. And 55 already, Jesus. And already taking the lead back is Vega. Vega going to block that up B from Bandit. Another up B. Not going to connect for Bandit. And that's going to be the Disable F Smash. And Vega is just one stock away from winning Cave Clash 71. Needing one more. St Hold on. Sitting at 104 is Vega. Bandit at 19 on the last stock. Back air coming from Bandit. Bandit missing the fair. I guess Vega enough time to do the his dash attack. Nair coming off from Bandit. Try to do the up B. Tries to go for a back air. Missing both back airs. Third one getting shields. And it's going to be a up tilt from Bandit to get the stock. Needing one more stock still. Well, both players now need one more stock. Bandit needs one more stock to stay alive in the tournament. Grab forward throw from Vega. Vega. 
Getting hit by the up B from Bandit at the ledge. Missing the side B. Try to go for the Nair, but now able to get that to connect. Fair comes out from Bandit into a fair into a Nair and then a fair again. An upper coming out from Bandit. And a neutral B from Vega. Vega has just won Cave Clash in a 3-0 over Bandits. GG's to both players. GG's to both players as the winner of Cave Clash 71 goes to Vega. We might... I, wow, I just muted myself without realizing it. We might have a new contender in the community. I don't know. There was no loss, no Atakarasu, no Shane, no Saishu, no, no Little J. This tournament was pretty wide open, but Vega wins Cave Clash 71 in a 3-0 over Bandit. That is no easy feat. That is no easy feat. GG's to everybody involved.